Right now, Face Jasper will give you 30% off G Fuel. Enjoy. What is going on, YouTube? My name is Face Jasper, back with another video, and today we are gonna be talking about Tfu or Turner's crazy three month transformation. <laughs> First, I want to say I'm so, so proud of the work he's put in. He's super consistent. He's showing to all of us that he's not only consistent and good in video games, but also in real life, he can dedicate himself to something and really go for it. I want a round of applause for my boy Turner right now. Now, if you don't know who Tfue is, you're living under a rock pretty much because Tfue is one of the biggest gamers on the planet right now. Now, to give a little backstory on how I know Turner or why I'm talking about Turner in the first place, I've known about Turner for two years. Since he joined FaZe Clan, I've known about Turner. Now, if you're watching this video and you don't know who I am, that's no problem. I'm FaZe Jasper, I work for FaZe, and I am pretty much responsible for everybody in FaZe who wants to do anything with health, fitness, and help them with their diets workout routines and anything like that. Now, in the most recent three months, obviously he's not working for FaZe anymore, but I continue to work with Turner because I really like him and he's really nice. This three month transformation that he made from January to now is just incredible. This is not the first time that I've worked with Turner on a workout routine and this is definitely the best result that we've got. And I wanted to go over it in this video because I want you, the viewers, to see that nothing comes easily and sometimes it's just a little bit of tweaking and working out different things that you really like for the result to come. From January to the end of March, he made a very impressive transformation. In this video, I wanted to go over some of his plans that I've made for him. Let's just start at the beginning and that's gonna be phase time. Turner is a streamer. He streams about eight hours, I would say, a day. But Turner is a very active guy. He loves to go outside, go surf, go jet skiing. He jumps off bridges, does backflips. He's a very active dude. He loves being outside. But in the meantime, he's also a very active gamer, an active streamer. That means he's on his PC for a majority of the day. Nothing wrong with that, but if you want to get in shape, you have to also increase your activity outside of that gaming session. Okay, so I wanted to go over one of the first workout routines that I made up for him. I set him up with a four day workout routine, which was not only lifting some weights and resistance training, but also some cardio, high intensity interval training type of style training to also get his cardio up and get a little bit more fit because I think that's also very, very important. And it also gives you a little better idea of what type of training there is and what you like so at the beginning i like to put people on stuff that they can learn from and they can do to get results but also so they can see what they like if take a look at the screen right now i put up this first, first workout routine um it says face t food rip Four days a week, he wanted to start off with four days. He wants to gain some muscle and he was at the face house gym. I just put a little general tip and advice here. Um, for anyone who's starting out, there's a lot of information to come with fitness and to working out and getting results. So I wanted to get the basics done because it's very important to know a few basic rules. Our form over weight, always try to perform the correct way. It's one of the most important things, that's why I put it first. It's very important to realize that the weight does not always matter. And exactly, when you start off, you wanna get your form straight because that's gonna be the base layer of your workout life. So you want, always wanna do it well so you can prevent injury in the future. Second one, it's gonna take some time to see progress visible. A lot of people get discouraged in like two weeks so because they don't see any difference. I told them as well, like it's gonna take a couple, like a month or a month or two for you to see actual visible things uh, changing in your body, which is really awesome, but stay patient. Try to finish all exercises, if not, that, but if, not if it's too much, cut back in sets. Uh, pretty much saying like you want to try out all the exercise you want to get your exercise You know um, library as you can say uh, as big as possible So you can you can do a lot of stuff and you can learn a lot uh, It also prevents from you from skipping certain muscle parts like it's not good if you're gonna skip You know full body parts because we're gonna train full body So training is 30% other 70% will come from diet It's like a, this is more like a general thing to say like 30 70 like the percentages don't really matter the thing is it's Training is important, but the thing outside of training is more important because there's no results without it. So I wanted to get that clear. The percentages like 
whatever. Uh, each week, try to remember what way you use and try more. Only if form is performed the correct way, stay safe. So yeah, progressive overload basics, like you want to start using more weight if you're if it's possible, so you can make progress and gain some muscle. Uh, that's pretty much the way it is. General tips, that was for training. And then for diet advice, I put in proteins are muscle rebuilders. Uh, check diet guidelines file for ideas. I sent him a little file with some you know, some ideas for proteins, for carbs, from fats, so he can, you know, make up his meals or, or if he orders something, he can, you know, order stuff that he recognizes from this, from the guidelines file. It's like, hey, chicken is good for, for some high in proteins. I'll um, order some chicken, you know, it's stuff like that. A weight gainer is great to sip on during stream or scrims to get some extra calories in. For some of you who don't stream or play a lot of video games, it's different, but for streamers and people who play a lot of video games, getting snacks in is very hard because you play a lot and you like, you eat some random shit. And he needed to hit a certain amount of calories, so we needed to make sure that he was hitting those calories, but it's very hard if you don't, if you stream for eight hours and don't really eat. So that's why I put in a weight gainer because it's like, it's a shake, you can sip on it, it's very easy to put down and to drink, and it contains like 600 to 800 calories depending on what you put in it. So that's why I, uh, I put these general tips in here because I think it's very important for him. This was the first time he worked out in the schedule in a routine, so it was very important for him to um, know those basics. The diet, obviously, as I said before, is very, very important. I never, almost never, unless they really request it, I almost never give exactly a diet plan. Like, exactly like morning, eat this amount of grams, this. I don't think in a quick second that for someone who is streaming or playing a lot of video games or is not anyone pretty much who is not doing a bodybuilding competition or training to be an athlete, it's beneficial for them to have a very strict diet. The reason is, it sucks. Turner wanted to get in shape. It's not his first, he's not a fitness influencer or he's not a bodybuilder. He wanted to get in shape and he wanted to live a little bit more healthy. What I always do is put them on X amount of calories and break their macros down. Turner, he wanted to gain some weight, so he obviously wants to bulk up a bit because he's 165 and he is very skinny, 6'2 or 6'3. Even if you order stuff, right? I always tell him, like, it's okay to order, just make healthier choices. Like, don't go out and eat Big Macs, get some calories in or, or get some, you know, drink a bunch of soda for sugar. Don't do that. That's, that's obviously not the right way. But I prefer to do the calories and macros thing uh, over the very strict foods, cook everything, weigh everything. Because for a lot of people, it's just not sustainable for a long period of time. And there's no, like, there's no point if you're gonna do it for two weeks and then quit, there's no point in doing it. So I put him on 3,200 calories at first. Um, of course, I'm not with him. I don't know him very well personally. I don't know what his eating habits are. Um, so it's, it's, it's a guesstimate, like how much I think uh, by a certain formula, how much he would need uh, to consume to gain some weight. Uh, with 198 protein, which is a little high if I look at it now, I would have lowered it even, but at the same time, getting 100 fats in and 370 carbs could be a problem. So, so let's fast forward to 2019. Whoa, the world was fun in 2019. Now we're f I got a message from Turner, he said, hey Jasper, I really want to build a home gym uh, in my warehouse that he bought. What should I get? What kind of pieces are very important to have? And I just gave him a list of stuff that I thought would be the basics, right? Like he pretty much built a gym for himself and his friends, which is really freaking awesome. So now we could really get into business. In January, he started a new workout routine. It was the 16th of January. I sent him a six day workout split. It's gonna be a push pull leg split because that makes a lot of sense for six days. Let's go over this workout split because I think this is a great workout split for him. It worked out really well. In three months, he got crazy results because he was eating correctly. He was training correctly. He was pushing himself in the gym, like literally asking a lot of the right questions, which is really, really awesome. So I wanted to go over this workout split really quick. This six day workout split that um, I will put in the description you guys can use it. I think that's really awesome for you guys to try if you are a beginner and you want to put on some muscle. This is a great workout for you to start off with. Gym day number one, push day. So the split is push-pull legs, push-pull legs. We have six days 
for tr of training in the week and we want to hit everything twice a week. So push pretty much means chest, shoulders, triceps because all those muscles you train by pushing stuff away. Now Turner told me he really wanted to train chest and want to get his chest big up so that's why we put three chest exercises in. The bench press, four sets of eight, all your overhead press OHP, four sets of eight as well with two to three minutes of rest time. You want to really take your time on these exercises because these are the ones that when you're going to progress, you're going to progress well and it's going to you know, give you the most gains. Uh, then we went for an incline dumbbell press. He had a bench that could go incline, just a little different angle than the regular bench press. Uh, four sets of 10, want to get a little bit more volume in. Uh, same with side raises for the 10. Cable fly, which is obviously a great one. He, he bought a cable machine, which is really dope. Uh, close grip bench press, great compound for triceps and cable extensions um, as well. Both four sets and a one eight reps and 10 reps. Then for pool day, obviously pool day is the back, traps, biceps, back and bicep day pretty much, but uh, rear delts as well. We start off with weighted pull-ups. Now I said weighted in brackets because maybe he's not able to do pull-ups with weighted yet or even pull-ups in general. He made some crazy back gains. I will show you guys right now on the screen. He made some crazy, crazy gains. Um, lat pull-down, obviously great exercise for the lats. A low row, which is pretty much a seated row, which is really awesome. A dumbbell row to get some variation in. And then face pulls for the rear delts, because it's also very important for posture. And then two bicep exercises, easy, some barbell, some cable. Again, I wanna get some variation in these exercises so you can learn about them and see what he likes and what he doesn't like. They're gonna be good anyways. If you do them correctly, they're gonna be great. No matter what you do, dumbbell, barbell, cable, they're all great exercises, but you know, some variation is fun, you know? Then legs, squats, very important. Good mornings for some hamstring glutes. These are kind of hard sometimes. For some people, they're very hard to do. Walking lunges, they suck, but they're great. Uh, kettlebell swings, also great exercise. A little bit more of a cardiovascular exercise as well, but uh, we went for reps instead of time. Cable crunches for abs, planks, and a plate a side raises for some obliques, and the calf raises. He messaged me a couple days ago. It's like, like, I need my calves up. Like, calves sometimes are just the way it is. <laughs> like, nobody, like, if you have great calves, you're lucky. So yeah, the rest of the workout you can check in the description. I um, because this is gonna take a lot of time. It's, it's already a very long video. The, the the thing that I want you to get away from this video is that in three months he went from 170 ish to 185, looking super lean, looking super ripped, looking super in shape by training consistently for three months and eating well. Other than the dedication to it, it doesn't take a lot of shit or crazy talent. Everybody can do it. Like you can do it. I can do it. Turner can do it. It's like, it's, it's the same for everybody here. We can do it, but you gotta put in the work. And that's why I said in the beginning of the video, Turner is someone who can put in the work with streaming, with his gaming, with his fitness. Like you have to put in that dedication. If you want to start working out you can check out the, the workout in the description i'll put it there not every detail matters as much don't like take small steps like don't go into this thinking i need to have everything in check when i start day it's okay for your diet to be messed up at the beginning it's okay for you to not finish your workouts because you can't it's okay and then slowly build up to that 100 percent lifestyle thing that is really awesome because working out is great Everybody loves working out. There's only benefits to working out. So if you enjoyed this video, please leave a like, subscribe if you are new, if you are into working out, you want to get some more workouts in, make sure to follow the channel. I'm all about fitness. Follow me on Instagram as well. All that shit. You can follow me on there. I appreciate you guys watching. Uh, Turner, I'm very proud of you. You did very, very well. You made some crazy gains. And um, yeah, I'll see you guys later. Deuces.